Denmarkian, the language spoke by people from the country Denmark. Hey there, beautiful faces. Do you guys know how many beautiful people we are on this channel now? We are 25,000, you guys. <gasps> that's so cool. Thank you so much for being here. That's like more people than live in this city I live in here in Denmark. So, yeah. What? <laughs> We could take over this city. Anyway, on a side note here, which has nothing to do with this amazing news, I'm having a bit of a slow day today, you know, a bit of a grey day. I'm starting second semester tomorrow and I don't really feel the motivation yet on this rainy Sunday, if you know what I mean. So I just thought I would do a little reaction video for you guys today. I hope that's okay with you guys and in that way I'm not even going to know what's going to happen in this video. I've reacted to Urban Dictionary's opinion on Denmark before but there was a lot more to go through than that so why not go through it now? <sighs> I'm gonna make french fries later. And we are officially started. Oh. Stop it. Okay, last time I searched Denmark and a bunch of shit came up. And I'm kind of curious about this one, people. That is not even a word, guys. Denmarkian, top definition, is an often misspelled person from the country Denmark. Okay, okay. The correct word is they, which apparently is some random awesome dude as well. Who is this random awesome dude? Two, Denmarkian, it's not a word. That's what I said, yay! People from Denmark, Danes, speak Danish and are Danish, not Denmarkian. Get it right. Also, Danes are not racist. <gasps> Stop generalizing. <gasps> oh, this is the first person I've come across who said that. I'm so happy. Hola, uh, uh, please be my friend. Three, Denmarkian, Vorein, kid who drinks a lot and play beer pong. Just spit on myself. <laughs> typically from Europe. <laughs> Denmark. Yeah, yeah. Denmark is typically placed in Europe. This isn't Denmark, you can't speak Denmarkian. This sandwich is Denmarkian. <laughs> Let's try another word. Denmarkism. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Denmarkism. 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 Well, I'm an idiot. A fan made religion. Whoa. A fan-made religion based off the anime Hitalia, similar to Doritos... Uh, nope. Which worships the character Matthias Köhler or Denmark. You know, I've heard of the anime Hitalia before in the comments. Uh, since I make a lot of videos about Denmark, people often tell me to go watch Hitalia because it's very funny. But I've actually never been able to find it without having to pay for it. And I'm the kind of person who don't want to pay for things if I don't know if I like it yet. So I haven't watched that. But already now I'm like, ah, uh, Kurla? This could just be whoever made the post's mistake. But um, this is not a Danish letter. It's German. It's an O umlaut. And now you're probably like, but Louise, they don't have the Danish er on their keyboard. Still, we don't use that. Ever. Let me give you a lesson. If you don't have the Danish letters on your keyboard, this is the Danish letter U. Er. This is the Danish letter A. E. Great, thank you. And this is the Danish letter O. You're welcome. Denmark is everything to a true Denmarkist. He is the reason the sun rises and sets, why the world turns and the force behind every triumph of the human race. Oh, okay. Sounds great, you guys. <laughs> he is the supreme lord of Scandinavian hotness. His gravity-defying hair is the subject of mass worship. His act is unforgiving and often smites non-believers, the haters of the Denmarkism religion. Some common catchphrases used by Denmarkists include I hope you step on a Lego. <laughs> okay, I'll give you that one because it's very dangerous to say that and does hurt like hell. Like, this is the only definition. Okay, hardcore fan right there. Okay, Denmark. The Denmark effect. Okay, I'm curious. Okay, it's also the only definition. The feeling of overwhelming joy as a result of lowered expectations. Oh my god. This is every Danish person's life described in one sentence. Mind you, have your fucking genius. Like, I should buy this mug and drink tea out of it every day. <gasps> Oh, you can do that! <gasps> Guys, 
Denmark handshake. Giving someone a blowjob upon meeting them. Yeah, yeah. It's just like, hello! And then you just dive right in. The more you know. Yes. Denmark, sa Denmark sandwich. When you sandwich a person from Denmark in between yourself and the wall, this could be used in a romantic, sexual or violent setting. I gave that cunt at the convenience store at Denmark sandwich last week. I really don't have any other comment than Slimy Joe, the name fits you well. Let's dive further into this, shall we? Dane, top definition. The best guy you will ever meet. He will make you laugh and smile and deprive you of all your heart and soul and you will love it. One of the funniest guys to be around. He's very funny and cute. He may seem like the one that doesn't like to talk much, but when he's around his friends, he's hilarious. Danes always have a nice body and won't push girls too much. Danes are just like amazing and awesome. Um, Hashtag big dick. Well, apparently Danes are all male. But it is true that we don't seem like we want to talk, but when we're with friends, we're like, letting go. Let it go, let it go, I'm a woman guy. Fucking gray sky. Adjective for a person who is funny, a ladies man, and just really awesome. Ladies man, like, I feel like we're still in the male category. Dane, a person who comes from Denmark. This is actually the true definition and it's only number five. Okay, six, an individual that is capable of accomplishing anything and everything set in his or her path. Oh, I'm allowed to be a female in this one. A life marked by continuous perfection. A Dane is excellent at a lot of things. Drinking, smoking weed, sex, sports, you name it. Hashtag thug. Oh yeah, we're excellent at everything in the whole wide world. Like taking drugs, drinking, humping each other, and, and sports. D-A-N-E. Oh. Noun. Dumb as... Not gonna read that. I'm not falling into that trap. One who doesn't invite you to his parties because he's too cool, very popular, but only has a few true friends, sexy and can dance very well. Um, I kind of feel like this pose is very personal. Like, directly directed at somebody. <laughs> Dang, a pretty woman. Uh, yeah, we're only women now. It's great. Dane Compton, a boy who puts his own cum in his mouth. Well, just nice and quietly put the arrow away from that, yes? Dane, yet another term for cocaine. Because we already have such a great reputation with drugs and alcohol. Dane, the cockiest piece of shit you will ever meet in your life. He believes he's better than everyone. Again, I, I get the feeling that this is directly directed at someone. <laughs> oh, yet another personal one, yay. Dane, a fancy dinner. I could use some dinner. Another one. Danish. Danish girls. Yeah, let's get some women in there, shall we? Danish girls, highly attractive sex machines. Wow. Hot ladies, classy girls, sexual ma 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 Oh my god. Sexual maniacs. Kinda feel like I have a lot to live up to here. Danish girls, the biggest sluts on the planet. Okay, shall we just say that these two kinda balances each other out? <laughs> Just like Danish economy. <coughs> Danish hot dog. Mm. Okay, it's not. When jerking a guy from the front, you reach back and have him poop in your cupped hand and then continue jerking him. Oh, guys, this is supposed to be a delicious thing. Like, Danish hot dog is so good. Like, it's, a, it's a hot dog with everything on it, like, except poop. Everything, like, mm. Don't make this a bad thing for me, guys. Jerry, Charlotte, I'm done. No, no, just no. Ooh, Danishing. <laughs> Beautiful, good, nice looking. Huh? Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Yes. Let's just search Danish. The most badass mother dudes in all of Scandinavia. No, in all of Europe. Hashtag Vikings. Danish, the goddamn illest nationality. Denmark trumps all y'all other countries. Word up fucking Americans. Now, I, I recognize this username from the other video I made. This guy also made a post about the word Denmark. And again, Sultan Denmark. What is your problem with Americans? Like, I know their last election wasn't their brightest moment, but... Come on. And how dare you use the word Trump in the same sentence as my country's name. It's getting political. <laughs> Danish blowjob. An intense blowjob that is a form of cuck worship. The giver of the Danish blowjob lavishes the penis. 
I have to clear it, don't I? Doodle Bob Joe, um, are you talking about your own experience here? Because it's very well described. Because if it is, like, good job to that Danish girl. Just think we're going to end this video here. <laughs> Again, thank you guys so much for being here to reach 25,000 with me. It really is a great milestone for me, and I hope you'll be here if or when we reach the next milestone. Should I cross my fingers for 50? Do you guys think we could do that? I really didn't expect to come this far. I, I mean, I hope that our channel would, but I, that it actually became a reality is something else. It's, it's something very cool, and thank you so much for that. And I'm celebrating with french fries tonight. Anyway, so yet again, leave a thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe to me if you want more, because I really hope to see your beautiful face in my next video. And if you want to watch a video similar to this one, just click right there. Somewhere over there. Mm. Bye!